What is happening guys? Welcome back to another video here on the Hashtag United channel. LP here with Ryan Adams. Why are you saying LP? Today we are taking on Takeley FC for another away Essex Senior League fixture. We're currently sitting in first, they're sitting in fourth. The sun is out, the grass is cut. Ryan, should we do it? Let's do this. Uh, just for confirmation, LP is actually here, he's just on camera duty. I'm here, but we're missing a few people today, so sacred Stampy's coming to help. So this is how we set up. We've also got the gear here, commentary just here as well. Quite insightful, hello, yeah. Unbelievable, Jeff. Yeah, that's usually what's set. Um, the camera that I use is down there. Stampy's actually going to be using one of the cameras today as well, so I'm currently rigging up his camera. Um, but yeah, all everything that you see, is here and on that camera. So I'm here with our brand new sign in Lewis Halls. You're actually a goalkeeper. So talk to me now, like, why are you here? Um, so I've been at Basildon earlier on in the season and uh, Dev's approached me earlier, uh, like a week ago basically, and uh, asked me if I fancy coming over through Basildon obviously. And uh, yeah, had a few chats with him and um, yeah, just went from there basically. Had a few train, uh, train on Thursday and then yeah, straight in for today. Has Devs managed you in the past? Uh, no, I've never played for Devs before. I've played for uh, Keithy before at Tilbury, uh, one of my previous clubs. Um, but yeah, first time playing for Devs here. How are you uh, talking to Ross, yeah, man? Ross, Sign about a penalty? Yeah, man. Look, obviously, as you know, I've been out for a while. I ain't scored in ages. I'm literally starving here. Last week, I come on last 10, 5-2 up, penalty. I look around, I said, oh, who's the penalty taker? See my man here, Russ. I thought, yeah, you'll let me take one. He told me no, mate. Me and Russ ain't friends. It's good. Take off the direct. <laughs> 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 right, so talk to me about Fortnite. Your squad consists of yourself, LP, Jamie, George, and Lee Hersett. So I want you to answer me a quick question. Who dies first? Three, two, two one. one. <laughs> FIFA as well. FIFA as well. He does well. take me down. He dies you. first every game, and hey, you listen, know it. And bro. you know it. We, we were facing a very, very good squad. We all went down. BD come into the storm. What was Smudger doing? This. <laughs> what did you, you get for getting three kills in the storm? You come taking in the furlough. No, what'd you get? What'd you get? <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> no chill, Gil. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh. Oh no, that is bad. Oh no. Do you keep a count of how many people you drop on the floor? No, no, I don't, I don't. So in the last match video, we asked you guys to give us some questions that you'd like us to ask some of our players. I've chosen out a few, so I'm going to ask them to the boys. So I've come to you because you are my answer to this question, but who works the hardest at the club? Probably him. And I'm for it, mate. Who's the funniest player at the club? Yanni. Or Yanni. <laughs> So the link up play between you two has been absolutely incredible. I want to know where can I learn this you can't. telepathy? You can't. Can't. Apparently he's not going on. Look, say, say a number between one and ten. Mm -hmm. Yeah, count us down. Three, two, one, four. five. See? Four and five is nine. And nine plus two is eleven. Second half last week, set a standard I expect us to keep to in terms of our intent, our willingness to win the ball back, the energy and then the quality that come when we got the ball back. It's no surprise that when we apply ourselves out of possession in that manner, we become better in possession because it gives us better opportunities in better areas. That's what I expect from us again today. 
Sides up. I'm keeping that same shape with Sammy behind George and Jesse as we as we finished last week. Right? It, I say it every single week. It is about us. It's always about us. Right? We need to hit a consistency now in our performances, and I'm expecting it to carry on today from last week. So let's go, boys. Come on. Lots of energy. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to another Hashtag United game. We're here away at Takeley for, I would say, one of the biggest games of the season so far because they're currently fourth. Well, it's very tight for points at the top of the table. We're currently top. And uh, for this big occasion, I brought in the big dogs, the Manj Dog. Thanks for Manj Dog managing on the commentary. Hello, everyone. Yeah, great to be here. Step five football. And Steps and Five are both some of my favourite 90s pop bands. So stop watching this video right now and research those things. I'm going to do it after, do it after the video, let's agree. Um, this is your third time, it's your hat trick of doing commentary with me, Faisal. We saw you did it last year. Hackney Wick at home, Fire away, now it's Takely away. We're expecting a tough test. Are you impressed that in the time in between that's passed, you're seeing now currently hashtag sitting top of a higher division? Yeah, the progression's fantastic. So it's good to see it from a distance and every so often drop in uh, to see the players up close and uh, watch them just go from strength to strength. Those of you that know your hashtag history will know Faisal Manjdog Manji is the first goal scorer in the history of Hashtag United and even played in the seven aside team back in the day for me. So it's great to see how far we've come. Should we take a look at the team playing for Hashtag today? Let's do it. Okay. In goal, newsflash, it's a new keeper, Lewis Hawes, making his debut in between the sticks. He comes straight in. In defence, we've got Jack Martin, Fryce Ngarno, Luke Wilson and Sam Biles. Centre mid, Ross Gleed and Ricky Evans. Ahead of them, Harry Honesty on the left, Sam Raj Gill and Jesse Waller-Lassen. And George Smith up front is in fine goal-scoring form. Double figures for the season already with 10 goals. On the bench, Ryan Adams, Josh Asude, Jamie Hurstit, Tashan Richmond and Izu. OK, we're underway here at Takeley. Special shout-out to Takeley in their special pink socks, phase. You might be thinking it looks a bit odd. It's because it's for charity. £2 of every ticket sold today uh, for the game goes towards uh, Cancer Research. I think that's fantastic by Takeley. So well done to them as they put the ball in early doors. And uh, look to get something going. Hashtag in the yellow shorts as well, which so far has been a winning formula for us. Every time we've worn it, we have been victorious. Sent forward by the uh, centre back only as far as Harry Honesty. He's got it here. He's got Gill to his right. Good tackle in the end. Now Florence can get on the ball. Good footwork from the winger. Playing it through the middle. Ten is offside. Keeper was off his line quickly. New man in, in between the sticks. Looking out for him, Manji. What, what do you think? Is there a lot of pressure on a keeper making his... His first game for a hashtag in such a big match. I'd say usually there would be, but with the calibre of Hashtag United's uh, resources, I think those people can step in, put the gloves on and dance. Dance indeed. He's done a great kick there to find uh, Biles, who found Jesse. And now it's come to Gill. Good football. Gleedy now on the ball. He's going to hit one from distance on the left foot. Off target. Back to Luke. Luke working it forward. First time on the left foot. Centre back gets across. Handball, free kick. Very much Faisal Manji territory. What would you be looking to do from a delivery here, Faisal? So this would be sort of first class type of delivery. I'd uh, package the, the ball well, uh, secure it with some gaffer tape, and then whip it to the middle of the box. Around the penalty spot. Yeah, I, I want to I tempt the goalkeeper. Here we go. He won't be able to get it. Gleedy's drilled that one low. It might be too much on it. Keeper yeah, he's, gone well. for, he's gone for a driller there. They can work. They can work. Not that time. Got to get the flight. Bang on. George Smith holding the ball up in the box. Playing it back to Ricky, who hits the shot nicely on the left foot, but just over the bar. Yeah, lovely little passage of play there, George Smith. The target man making himself an option from the throw and allowing Ricky Evans to get a shot away. We need more of that from those two. Well played. Been great to see if that hit the target, whether it would have troubled the keeper. Jack Martin's going to get the ball back for us now. Harry Honesty trying to get under control. So much Gill's made a run. He's going to find Jack Martin, though. Getting forward from left back. Jack to deliver across the box. Cleared. And as far as Todd, the captain, who gets there before George Smith. And now Takely can look to mount a counter-attack. We've got bodies forward, but Ross Gleed gets across. Sent long by the other Gill, the goalkeeper for Takely today. Luke Wilson with a big header. There was a video that went viral this week of a defender scoring a header from a similar situation. Gleedy gets the ball down with what the Takeley supporters thought was a high foot, but ref says no. Harry Honesty on the ball. Looking to beat his man for pace, and he's done him with ease. Can he deliver now? Harry pulls it back. What sort of cross were you looking for there, man? Maybe a, a, more of a curler instead of a uh, 
A pass back. Just to flash it across that six-yard box just outside. Harry uh, pulled it back a little bit too much there, so it wasn't something for the, the strikers to run onto. Harry's still on the floor here. I think he took a bit of a hit to the face. Jack Martin fancies one from distance. Worth a go. I'll tell you what, keeper was not ready for that. He was thinking about his dinner there. Should have been keeping an eye on the ball. Farai. Sending it long towards George Smith and Sam Rad, who are very close to each other. George with hands all over him. Free kick. Faisal Manji territory. George again causing a nuisance and allowing Hashtag just to establish themselves in the final third. So let's see what we can do from this. Who's going to be on it, Spence? Well, Gleedy actually scored a free kick here from a very similar range last week. That was a left footer. Jesse has been the, the taker of most free kicks recently as a right footer. But if you, I mean, is it too far to shoot in your, your professional opinion? This is far. This, this would be outside of my range, but I don't think the keeper has looked particularly confident. So why not give it a go? And just follow it in as well. Looks like it's going to be Jesse to hit it. He does hit it. Oh, it was just dropping in for Luke Wilson there. He got his first goal last week. Yeah, snuck one into the back post there. Nice idea. Got the corner. Jesse to deliver then for hashtag. Ball in. Good pace on it. The George Smith, it's bounced off his midriff. I don't think he was expecting it or knew much about it. Yeah, flash past Ricky Evans on the near post there. Then came to George quite quickly. Couldn't do anything with it. Taking a lot of their goal kicks quickly today. Looking to get these attacks going in a swift manner. And they've done just that as the left-back's continued his run. And there's a man free at the back post who he looks to find. Jack Martin doesn't get a touch to it. It comes to Das now. Hits the shot. Deflected off Martin. Biles, or Ricky Evans knows Biles got a touch to it. Comes to the skipper on the edge of the box. Good football from Takeley. Eventually lost though. And Gleedy can send it forward. George Smith's going to chase this. Got a chance here. The striker hits it deflected. And you have to say, good improvisation from the keeper. Yeah, that was a, a, a chance of their own downfall there, Takeley. Bit complacent at the back and George smelt the opportunity. Got his shot away, but unfortunately hit that deflection and made it a little bit easier for the keeper. Gill's going to take it on the left foot. There's the ball. It's coming from out. Whipping in. Luke Wilson rises well. Heads it over. Jesse can't control it. It's a tough one. And a little bit off the ball incident there between Luke Wilson and the number 10. Lino's given it. He said there was a trip from Luke on uh, Das. Ball in from Takeley. It's a good one. Keeper comes and doesn't hold on to it. Punches it high. Harry Honesty's going to help out. And send it long. Jesse will pile some pressure on now, as will Samraj Gill. So Humphrey who sends it back to the keeper, Gill. The two Gills on the pitch. Luke Wilson wins his header. Only as far as Florence, though, takes it down with a composed first control. Lovely ball into the box, offside. Give me ball, ball coming into the box. Rickens clears it against the skipper. Farai gets on it, and now Jesse can play it to Gill. Gill with a man closing him down, takes a good touch and wins the free kick. No, ref's going to play advantage. Jesse on the ball, he's got Biles making strides down the right. George ahead of him, looking to beat his man here. Runs into trouble, wins a free kick. The dangers of the counter-attacks, they do it themselves. Really looking for Luke Wilson who gets ahead to it, but once again cannot find the target. Clearly the, clearly the target for us in the box is Luke Wilson, but he's just not quite getting the connection. The, the goal's the best target in the box. You want to be hitting that. If you can hit the goal, that's four. That's good advice, to be fair. I'll tell them. Okay, corner for hashtag. Can we get something before half-time? About 10 minutes left of the first half. Jesse going to deliver this in on his right foot. Gleedy making a run at the front post. It goes to the back. Luke Wilson once again wins his header in the box, but cannot find the target. Big Willie style there. Just uh, didn't go platinum. The ref does like to let it play, doesn't he? Not only is he using advantage a lot, but he's letting a lot of things slide, which is often good for the game. He's not going to let that slide, though. That was a late challenge from Ricky Evans. But no, no card, just a free kick. Ball in for Takeley. He's going to... Ask the question of the keeper, Hawes, who comes and claims it confidently. It's what Better we want. there. Stuck onto the ball there, unlike the last time. Sent forward. Jesse could chase this. It's going to bounce. Keeper's going to be asked a question. Jesse gets it up. Harry Honesty hits it on the volley. You know what? It had shades of that league winning goal away at Hackney Wick, which he hit on a similar kind of pivot turn. This one, I couldn't direct goalwards. Absolute Zlatan pivot there. So the long ball caused havoc for take. That's a few times, really, they've played themselves into trouble. Mix up at the back. Harry almost capitalises. And that would have been a, a nice little breakaway goal for Hashtag. Sent forward. 
Jack Martin gets there. And nice, just holds it up. Good composure from Jack. Gleedy now. Going to send it forward towards Jesse. Can he take it down in the box? Keeps it with a chest. He's got Harry behind him. Nice turn. Still Jesse. Can he find a man? Still on the ball here. Very, very good from Jesse. Oh, he just kicks it into the side netting after all that. Dynamic play there from Jesse. Sold the defender about six dummies and uh, almost made something of it. But that's a little bit better from Hashtag. I like that. I like that. Well, it's half time here at Takeley, and it is nil nil between the two sides. In a, in a half, they didn't have loads of chances, Faisal. But what did you make of it? Tense. Very tense. We definitely are in a game here. Takeley are a good team. And that midfield needs, that battle needs to be won there because it's very open. There's a lot of pressure being applied, and we're going long too much and not really showing our quality. So, big half time team talk. But we know Devs has got that in his locker, and uh, I think we can see a little bit more from us in the second half. Yeah, we'll see what Devs has to say and we'll come back for the second half shortly. Nil-nil. Information's got to be better. It's too quiet. We're too, re too <coughs> reactive of, of what our own teammates are going to do. We need to be more composed in possession, more composed with our pass, our final ball. We are relaxing or slowing things down at the wrong times. Move the ball quickly. Move the ball quickly and with a purpose. It is just about stepping up, stepping up. 15%, 15% in what we've got and, and then we'll, we'll have enough because it's kind of been okay but not enough. And while it's okay and not enough, it always gives the opposition a chance, always gives them a sniff, always gives them opportunity. We've seen from a goal kick and a chase, opportunity come from it. More from us, come on, don't just accept this. It, it'll feel like it's missed if we, if we don't, if don't step up, come on. And hashtag Ricky Evans gets us underway for the second half. Yeah, it's a really lovely tree here at the FSI Stadium, right in line with the halfway line. You see it on the uh, the shot. It kind of reminds me of The Lion King. Have you seen so. the remake? Uh, no, I haven't, but it's all in the circle of life, mate, so I know what happens. Sam Biles has got a difficult ball to deal with here. Closed down by the striker, gets ahead to it, but he's in now. Chance for the top goal scorer. Farai is there to stop the threat. Samraj Gill now running forward. Gets a throw in. Thrown towards George Smith. Trying to get it back into play. Sent forward by Takeley. Wilson with a big call and the big header. Headed backwards by the four. Harry honestly leaps so well. George Smith trying to get under control on his left foot right now. Over to his right. Back to his left. Just hesitated slightly. Just shows the competitiveness there in the midfield. You're going to have to pull out some skills and you're going to have to find a pass. And there's not much space. Jack Martins just... Given uh, Das a little bit too much space. He puts the ball into the box. Could come across to the eight. Takes a touch. Didn't fancy it on the left foot. Curled it on the right instead. Wide of the post. Yeah, good chance there. Comes in from the right-hand side. And he just tries to set that one outside the post and bend it back. But never had enough on it to, to come back inside the post. Humphrey into Florence. Takely playing better football now. Looking more live in the second half. Farai gets an important header to the ball. Florence seeing a lot of it right now, but Ricky coming away with it now. And looking for George Smith. Good touch. He's got a ball on for Jesse if he can see it. It's a fantastic pass. Jesse takes it down. Here's the shot. Oh, and it's off the bar. And it could come to Joshua Sude here on the rebound. Who can't control it. But what football from George Smith and Jesse. Unbelievable chance there. George picking out a great ball to Jesse, who almost gets it right. Cannons off the bar. Really enjoyed seeing that. That was fantastic play. Jack Martin with the header. Keeper's not come for it. A little bit of miscommunication there, but Luke eventually clears it. Asude, good pass into Gleedy, asking a bit of a question of him, but he gets the one-two, and now he's got it back from George Smith. Josh Asude gives it back to George. George keeping it on his chance. Oh, it's a good shot. Rebound for Gleedy on the right foot. That's better. Chance is coming thick and fast for Hashtag, and just that cut and thrust on the right-hand side that Josh Asude provides. A uh, real danger now uh, with Hashtag going forward. I think that goal's coming, Spence. Closing down Barnett now. Still on the ball for Takeley. Oh, he's fallen over and he's deliberately used his hand. And that's got to be a booking, is it not? Deliberately just dragged, stopped the counter-attack by, by holding the ball. Yellow card then for Barnett. Gleedy finds Jesse quickly off this free kick. Sude looking for that run. Jesse trying to find him. Sude might get there before the keeper. He does. Keeper gets something on it. Hit on the turn by George. Again deflected and Takeley have defended resolutely, it has to be said. 
Farai's touch gets away from him, but Wilson should get there. This all new right-hand side for hashtags. Very threatening. Uh, nothing against the, the previous boys in those positions, but Josh is definitely bringing some pace to the party here. Harry Honesty, left foot cross, leaves a lot to be desired. It's great, you know, uh, signal to our strength in depth that we can bring a Sude on. We've still got Tashang, we've still got uh, Ryan, we've got Albie Keese next to us here in the stand, injured. Loads of players missing out. Neil Richmond. Corner for Taker. They're queuing up on the edge of the box like a Takerly train. The ball comes in on the left foot. Needs to be cleared. Harry Honesty doing very well to head that away. Now the substitute, Miles, is returning it to the corner taker. Puts it in low. Luke Wilson meets it. Headed away and Miles there has actually flicked it back. And Sude is going to close this down. The, the ground he makes up is, is unbelievable. Ricky Evans with the header. It's going to come over to Jamie Hersey with loads of time. He's rushed his pass there, but it could come through to Jesse. And now Sude's got a chance for his first goal for Hashtag! And Joshua Sude beats the keeper at the near post off the bench. What a moment for It that. was coming, Spence, wasn't it? Great moment to see here. Crucial time of the game. And Josh just made a name for himself. He's won the academy and he's won the hearts and imaginations of Hashtag fans across the land. And now he's won some more fans with that goal, which could be huge. The pressure was building and I said at half time, we can be clinical, this game's ours. A few chances came before and Josh really up the ante, bringing a real threat to the game here. How many times this season have we seen some devs substitutions change the game? Once again, it's a goal from a man off the bench. So free kick for Hashtag on the left side. Can they double their lead here? And put the real pressure on Takely. Jesse's going to whip it in. It's a good ball. So asking a question, you know, I think it might have been one of those cross shots. A few people calling that it might have gone over the line. No goal line technology in the Essex Senior League, Faisal. But what do you think of that delivery? Absolute whippage on toast. Probably granary. Uh, great delivery from Jesse. Towards Das, who heads it on into the box. Looking for Barnet up against Farai. Played back to Das. Headed high and over by Hurstit for a corner. Here comes the corner for Takeley. Whipped in. Ow, oh, it's an open goal. It's a header that's got across the defenders and the keeper. I think it was it was Castle, the number six, who had the chance. And he, I don't think he connected with it, Faisal. Yeah, it wasn't the king of the castle in that moment. That was a golden chance for Takeley. Real big chance. And uh, it's fair to say we've got away with one there. Corner taken short. Tashan pushed to the floor. Still in that corner though, Tash doing really well to hold it up. Oh, it's fantastic work from Tash. Still Tash on the ball. Causing a real nuisance for them, winning a free kick. Exactly what you want from him. Spence, not only this fantastic game management and it's eating up time, but mentally it's just frustrating, Takely, right? They want to be in the opposite part of the pitch. We're keeping the ball right by the corner flag constantly. Taking short once again, really frustrating the Takely players now. Tash and Richmond's been brilliant in there, but they have got a chance to play out now. It will not be. Oh, it's actually a little bit of fisticuffs in the corner. I took my eye off it for a second as the ball came out, but they're not happy with Tash at all. Tash just needs to keep his call. Cool. Uh, ref has got a card. Double yellow. Yellow card for Tash and a yellow card for the number eight. Can't, park, can't park on one of those, Spence. Double yellow. There's two Takely players standing on top of each other. But the full team's done well there. That's Wade, the substitute. Asude helping out defensively now. Nika Stretchen. Just take it, Josh. Take it to the corner, Josh. Run, Forrest. Great tackle from Castle to come away with the ball there as well. That's fantastic from, from Castle. But Josh has not given it up either, which I love. Free kick's been given away, but Josh Asude's done well there. Keeper's going up. Keeper is going up. His name's Gill, not Samraj Gill. This is the Takely Gill. The goalkeeper is going up for this free kick. He's got permission from the bench. It cannot be long left if the keeper's going up. And they're taking it short, unbelievably. You'd be fuming if you <laughs> were the keeper. Oh, and it could go wrong. Seen before. And the ref's going to blow up the whistle to save the blushes of the keeper. But it is all over. It's a big victory. Do not be confused by the lack of potential goal uh, chances in this game. But that wasn't a big game. A huge three points separates us from Takeley, who are fourth going into the game. Keeps the winning run going. Basil Manager Dog Manager, what did you think and who's your man of the match? Oh, Spence, this was a big result for Hashtag, no denying that. 1-0 doesn't really reflect the full story of the game. Really tense, really competitive. Uh, a game of give and takely, and we gave it our all. 
came away with a win. The match of the match today, sponsored by that tree over there, is going to be... I mean, there's quite a few people that need a shout-out. I mean, most things creatively that were good. Uh, Jesse was at the end of George Smith battling away. Josh with his cameo performance. Great goal as well to seal the victory. But I'm going to give it to Luke Wilson at the back, who was just dominant in the air um, in a game where it was really tight. We needed that solidity and Luke provided that. Fantastic stuff. Thank you for joining me, Manage Dog Manager. Always a pleasure. Big three points for Hashtag. Very happy with that one. And the big games keep coming. We've got Whittam next in the game that was rearranged in the Essex Cup in the midweek game at home. So look forward to seeing you somebody there. Uh, but over to Devs now. Big win. Up the tags. Thoroughly deserved that. Thoroughly deserved second half. Uh, I thought we controlled the game. Um, could have scored earlier. Didn't panic when we didn't score. Then at 1-0, we showed another string to our bow, didn't we? We showed that we were able to defend when there was a little bit of pressure, but also see the game out and control the game. And large parts of the last 10 minutes were played in, in, in our final third. Uh, so that's really, really pleasing. One nil away from home. So it's a great result. It's a great result. And that's a tough test. That's probably the toughest test we've, we've had so far this season. But they're going to get tougher as well. We've got a tough period coming up, so there's nothing to get carried away about by any stretch. But that performance is pleasing. Great impact from substitutes again. Terrific finish. Really pleased for you. First goal. <coughs> Excellent. And you, when you come on in that, when we needed to manage that game and you did that thing where the ball sticks to your foot for 10 minutes and you draw three kicks and frustrate people, it was, was brilliant. But on the whole, that's a solid, not spectacular, but solid performance and a well-deserved three points. Well done. We're here with Josh Sude. Congratulations, Josh, on your first goal for the club. Uh, thank you very much. It's been a long time coming. I'm absolutely buzzing that I got my first goal and hopefully there's many more to come. And it was a good team performance today. What stood out for you? Um, well, we, we hold on together. Team, good teamwork and uh, at the end of the day, we've got the three points. Neil, it's a good 1-0 win away from home. What really stood out for you in that performance? Oh, I just think the work rate, I think, especially second half. I mean, we worked hard first half, but second half, I just think the work rate, we upped it, upped it a level and... I think there's only one team in it in the second half. Now, a few people will know that you're a, you're a player manager. Why aren't you playing right now? Uh, I got picked up a small hamstring injury. Tried to train a couple of weeks ago. Uh, aggravated it again. So <coughs> just trying to um, just trying to come back slowly. But the boys are doing well. At the moment, I won't get back in the squad. So as long as they keep winning, I'm happy. Um, yeah. And that is going to be the end of the video, guys. An absolutely insane battle here away at Takeley. We've come out on top. We've got the three points. How'd you find it? Absolutely loved it. What an absolute battle from the boys to get three points away from home. Makes for Saturday. Love it. So this is what the table currently looks like, guys. As you can see, we are there in first position. Gleedy, tell the people, when is our next game? This Wednesday, the 23rd, against Whitham Town at home at Tilbury. Come and watch. Well said. And hopefully we see a lot of you guys there. And if you aren't able to make it, make sure you go and check out the video. And yeah, if you've enjoyed this video, make sure to drop a like, hit the subscribe button as well, and make sure you press that notification bell to stay up to date with every single time we upload. And of course, what do we not forget to do? Don't forget to hashtag it. Love that. Come on.